Guess who's back in the house? Here's click clacking about. I hope that you guys are having a lovely day. Um, I wanted to review Shea Coulee's new video, Collide. Um, I've seen clips online, uh, but I wanted to give a raw review. All right, so I am going to YouTube. It's a, a weird video format. It's not like theater mode. So I think the person who is on the screen now is Jess. It is a collaboration with Jess and Mickey Blanco. I'm getting an amazing early 2000s R&B R&B pop vibe and I love this robotic suit it's very um, Terry Mugler and the um, 90s supermodel metallic uniform And every, every time you see this, like, some type of metallic uniform, like Beyonce or um, any kind of, like, um, rapper, actress, it's a Terry Mugler uniform. But this is designed by Joshua Aponte, uh, who has worked with a lot of the drag race queens. Oh, her makeup is incredible. The visuals are remarkable. It's like um, Metropolis, the black and white movie. Ooh. This is looks like an outfit change. This is a complete upgrade from her first video that she made, which was also really polished. But this is incredible. Ooh, ponytail action. I'm not afraid of a little disaster. I'm not going to call you after. It's going to be for one night. So this song is about hookup culture. And I think at the beginning, she represents like a sex robot. She's connected to a machine. And at one point, her shield is removed to reveal the gorgeous makeup. And I love that her eyebrows are even metallic. And it reminds me of a the cover of a music album um, that was like Metropolis inspired, but I can't think of it. Um, and it's the look that the the the, the helmet that the background dancers are wearing. It's that same idea. I just can't think of what it is. Um, but she becomes disconnected and she has a new um, outfit on. And so um, I guess now she is liberated. And so the visuals are gorgeous. Um, I love this music video. Um, it's just so good. Um, there's so many levels uh, to what's happening in the music video. And so we definitely know that this is going to be a song that's played at all of the gay clubs, especially in Chicago, at Roscoe's. Um, the gays are going to lose their mind over this song. 
Um, and I will definitely be on the dance floor in a gay club vibing to this song. Um, okay, so this was directed by Shay Coulee and an individual named Jordan at, I don't know if it's VAM or VAM Studios, but VAM Studios is um, a studio owned by a black queer man. His name is Vincent Martel, and he works primarily with filmmakers who are people of color or non-binary or uh, who identify as queer. And so I really love that. Shay, um, I think in January or February, sounds queer. And so I really love that. Shay, um, I think in January or February, signed with UTA, which is United Talent Agency, um, based out of Beverly Hills. And that was major because they represent Johnny Depp, Angelina Jolie, Anthony Hopkins, they represent kind of like classic Hollywood. And the deal, specifically work on her music career and touring career, um, Shay is going to go on a massive tour in 2022, but they're also going to manage endorsement deals. And she had one with Goose Island, a beer company, and uh, they're also going to manage Shay on uh, scripted projects, uh, which is major. And so, of course, because of that relationship, um, I wonder if um, kind of like the people behind the scenes um, were brought in uh, through UTA and... It is, there was like an entire team that was a part of this. And so um, I am so impressed with this video. Um, there was an assistant director, a second assistant director, a director of photography. Um, and there was a VFX um, artist who specifically designed the special effects. And so there was even a drag assistant who was Brandon Brown. Overall, I give this video an A+. This is probably the best music video from a drag race alumna. And um, also the sound is incredible. Um, Shay's voice sounds wonderful. I don't know if she had like a, a singing coach or a vocal coach. Uh, the voice sounds really good. I love the harmonies. Um, maybe because G's, um, I didn't hear them. So maybe they were like a co-songwriter. I'm not sure, but. Um, maybe it was um, their voices were blended. I did not hear that person, but I, I definitely know that it was the person at the beginning of the music video. A plus, tens across the board. And I'm actually, I haven't seen any of the Drag Race uh, contestants when they toured, um, like Adore Delano or Aja, but I would see Shea kool in a concert, not doing drag, but just singing. If the tour is going to represent what I saw in this video, hands down, front row seats, I would watch it. Because I can't wait to see costumes, hair, um visual projections it is going to be top tier uh, top tier production um thanks for watching this video 
If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, like the video, and leave a comment. And if Shay comes to your town, are you going to see her? Um, let me know your thoughts. Until next time, have a lovely day. Besos.